Hello and welcome to how to make a basic menu. Um, these basic menu will include some of the following features. A start button, um, a help button, an information button if you choose to, um, and some other buttons that you may need. If you have any more buttons that you'd like to add just leave a comment in the comment section. Okay, so this is my game. I only have the room for you to play. So I need to put on a menu for it. So you create a room. Okay. But I want this to be first. So no. swap in order. So that's there. Okay. And when you click on it it's grey so you can change that if you want um, you can also change the size I recommend it being the size of your room but if your room is um, you, you have to scroll to see all of your room I wouldn't recommend making it that size so this is a pretty good size you can change it by doing this um, Rename it, I'm going to call it Start Menu. Okay, so you can go to Background and change the background colours. If that's not on it, I think it goes just black. One sec. Yeah, it goes just black. So put it to a colour you want, like that. and get a object and make it called a play button uh, give it the play button in a minute we'll just make it at first so mouse left pressed event okay so when you left press the button, um, main one, next room, you can change the effects. Okay, so that'll take you to your next room, which should be your level room, or if you've got a character select screen, which I'll tell you how to make in my next tutorial, it will take you to there, or whatever the next room is. If you don't want it to take you to the next room, you could move the room or you could type in code um, control execute code room underscore go to underscore and then type in room so room zero I think oh room underscore go to next bracket room zero and it'll take you to room zero or if you've got another room after room zero and you don't want to get to room zero you can always change that to if it was called room one room one so yeah I'm just gonna leave oh delete that main one okay now make the button sprite there yeah. I've already got a sprite for it play these come with game maker 8 so you should have it if you've got game maker 8 then put that in your room oh, object play and put it wherever you want and then you can get any other ones, I'll see what other buttons I've got um, a quit button, a save button save and load 
um, empty buttons and you can type in them help button we'll use a help button now make a object help give it the help button sprite okay um, you can have a look at some of the functions on here and come up with your own buttons there's one here, your main two info oh, mouse left press event dragging info display message and you can change that to whatever so um, you use arrow keys to advance the level or something like that and there's many functions you can even type in code if you can't drag one in you should be able to drag one in but um, create another sprite and we'll put all these in our room after um, sprites let's see what I've got Help. The quit button. Spear quit. Okay. Make it into an object. Object quit. Mouse left press. There is um other ones on here. These are for joysticks. If you can got a USB to plug in. I'll probably tell you about global left pressed um, another time. You can probably work out the rest. Um, control. Ah, here are some of the more interesting ones on the main two tab. You've got end game, restart game, save and load game. I'll do a saving and loading tutorial start menu uh, quit oh it has no sprite so it will come up with that so give it the quit sprite object 8 my hypercam will cut off this I'll um, Minimize it in a minute for you. Put help on object help. Okay, let's see what it looks like. And um, you can also put animations that go across the screen, and you can use wrap screen like I've used in my previous tutorials, and um, how to animate sprites in Game Maker. Okay, so we've got our help. Pull it with your message. You can also um, edit this, like in my previous tutorial. Quit, ends the game, and play takes you to the next level, like so.